So let's graph and write the interval on the left here. We'll do this one in red. So you guys tell me which side you want the x's on, because it doesn't matter. Right. On the right. So we have a 10x on the left side. So we got to get rid of it. So I'm going to subtract 10x from both sides. And that also means that the plus 5 is on the wrong side. I'll have to subtract 5 from both sides. So that brings my inequality down. And I've got 19x minus 10x, which is 9x. And negative 4 minus 5, which is negative 9. Now remember, this is, this is comparing to a negative 9. But when we solve this one, we're going to divide both sides by a positive 9. So it doesn't flip the inequality on this one. Negative 9 divided by 9 is 1. So I'll just, so I know I have enough space. Comparing with negative 1. This one is eating the x, so it goes to the right, and it's not included, so I have a parenthesis there. On the other side of this, we've got to distribute this 4 and the 3. We'll do it one at a time, though, so i got 4 times x is 4x minus 4 times 1 is 4. This is less than or equal to 3 times x is 3x plus 3 times 3 is 9. All right. Well, I would just put the x's on the left so that my coefficient is positive. So I got to get rid of these three x's, which are on the right. And I've got to get rid of that minus 4 by adding 4 to both sides. And I've got a 1x, which really I don't even need the 1 there. And this is less than or equal to 13. All right, and 13 goes to the right of that, negative 1. So here's 13. This one's not eating the x, so it goes to the left. And it's also equal to, so it's a square bracket right there. This one is an and statement. So we do want the intersection between these two, and they only intersect between these two numbers. Periodically, you guys will see this as well. Maybe sometimes it would go their opposite ways and look for the and statement. If that's the case, just know that there's no solution because they never intersect. This one also does want the interval. So I got a curved bracket at negative 1. It goes all the way to 13. And uh, there we go, the sandwich between the two. So this is my interval.